Yo, what's up? It's my mum's boy, Chico Bean, and I've been having a look at a couple of things, and I've noticed, um, I've seen a thing on YouTube, and they came up with this collective minds. Now, they used to do the stripe packs for the PS4 controllers, so you just plug and play, and you got your back buttons, um, apparently used to get aim assist, no recoil, um, all that sort of jazz. Um, but they're talking and apparently they've brought it out for the PS5. So I've had a look on here and, um, we'll just go through it. Um, yeah, it's just something different from normally my gameplay, but yeah, I, I sort of looked at it and I was like, Hmm. And on the YouTube, uh, channel they were talking about how you can actually program these program the buttons to be uh macroed so multi-button press um everything else anyway we'll go down here and have a look and it's pretty much giving you a description saying the dawning of a new strike pack experience has reached the horizon strike pack horizon uh both so you get two two modes uh, a game pack mode and a tournament mode by the looks of this uh, the new game pack mode features selectable game packs for mods so macros on demand which means um, multi-press on you or so while you're shooting uh, and you press your trigger in it'll shoot and you press your trigger out and it shoots so it's pretty much bang 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 um, and then obviously the, sh yeah, the basic f first and third person shooter needs while the action pack covers recording, fighting and action games. Um, I'm not going to go too much into it, but, um, it's pretty much saying, so you can program four back buttons, uh, endless mod, and it's pretty much like the Zen, uh, the Chronos Zen, but you don't have a full control over this, like the pro, the Chronos Zen, you can turn around and mod it and tweak it and really, really get into the nitty gritty. Um, but there'll be a lot of people that won't need to do this. Uh, but and it's also got an app, so you can use it on your on your uh, iPhone or Samsung or whatever, and you can modify it on your app to um, the buttons um, and do whatever. And all it is is goes on to your uh, DualSense uh, controller um, and pretty much, you know, if you start getting stick drift after six months, 12 months, you just pull it off, buy a new controller and put it back in and you've got back buttons and your macros and God knows whatever else. Um, but yeah, we'll go into the site and have a look to see what it does. Um, so it says, yeah, choose your side. So you obviously, so there are your four back buttons and on the right-hand side, you've got your paddles. Um, and obviously it's just telling you about your uh, app that you can do. But yeah, I just, I don't know. There's a lot of things going around and like um, Jack Frags posted up about a program on your PC that can turn around and pretty much have your mouse program like a controller and it says it's a controller i think he got a lot of flack for that but hey he's only just putting it out there for people to know and now on and like this is going to this is this is not just for playstation 5 because you know everyone knows you can use your um playstation 5 dual sense controllers on pc so I mean, this is going to be an absolute game changer. The only thing is, they are only shipping to uh, these three countries: so Canada, United Kingdom, and United States of America. So, I mean, if you have turned around and you can get an address in America, I think there's a, oh, I don't know, there's a program or something called My USA that you can actually pay. And what it does is it gives you an address that you can buy online if it's only in America. And it gives you an address and it gets sent there, but it also then redirects it and sends it over to your Australian address. Um, so, yeah, My USA, I think it's called. But, yeah, is this going to be a game changer for everybody? Uh, PS5 controller, strike packs from Collective Minds, four buttons. Um, now, they're also saying... It, it does your trigger, like your triggers, and it gives you click triggers. 
apparently, like on a dual sense on the um, new PS5 Pro controller, you actually can adjust the trigger set, like trigger uh, downpour. This one you can't, but what it does is pretty much as soon as you press your trigger, it fires. So you haven't, so you've got, you've still got that um, movement right down, but it pretty much is like a, um, like a, a click trigger on like your scuffs or whatever, but it, that, like the trigger still gets pulled right down. Um, but yeah, that's this uh, at the moment at 60 bucks USA. So you're looking at 80, maybe $90 Australian and then shipment. Yeah, and that, that's a killer. Yeah, you're probably going to be looking about 150 Australian dollars all up for a um, a pack that you can put on the back of your PlayStation 5 and it gives you, apparently gives you aim assist, super aim assist, um, no recoil, super no recoil, um, as I said, macro buttons, so you can pretty much like what people are doing on um, mouse and keyboard now with their macros. So as I said, when you press down, it shoots, and when you let go, it shoots. So it's pretty much bang, 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 bang. And it also, yeah, with your macros, you can turn around and have it to aim and shoot at the same time. So instead of using two buttons, you're using the one aim, shoot, aim, shoot, aim, shoot. Um, But yeah, that is this. Um... I'm not sure how it's going to go, especially at the price. Um, so obviously you got the Xbox One as well, and there's your strike pack for um, for your PS4. Obviously they're selling the Zen. <laughs> oh my god, Chico. Um, but anyway, that is that is the new Collective Minds um, strike pack for PS5. Uh, let me know how you think of it, what you think of it. Um, look, in all honesty, as I said, with these regions here, yeah, I live in Australia. A disadvantage for us is there's going to be people in America that are going to be using these straight away now. And it's pretty much cheating. It's giving you everything you want. No aim assist. Yeah, it's got giving you aim assist, no recoil. Um just a lot of other things um but at the end of the day uh, what hope have you got in trying to um nullify cheating when also msi have just brought out a um monitor that's got ai built in artificial intelligence built in that actually reads your um minimap and you can adjust it and you can fine tune it to either have arrows pointing to your um, enemy or put a red box around them, which is pretty much like um, wall hacks and that sort of stuff. So, I mean, it's going to get to a point where, you know, like Ricochet, Activision, you know, Battlefield, they're, they're all trying to nullify cheating because it's just ripe at the moment. But, you know, you have companies that bring out these controllers and, um, as I said, MSI are bringing out this, um, yeah, I think it's a 31-inch monitor with AI, so it reads the gameplay. And you can actually, on your computer, um you know, adjust things, and as I said, you can have it, that they put red boxes around your um, enemies. Um, i seen that it was in America at one of the big gaming or electronic shows, and they're playing uh, World of Legends or whatever it is. Oh, I don't really know the game, but it actually showed, yeah, they will put arrows or red boxes around the enemies because I was reading the minimap, and it just artificially... Um, intelligent and yeah so cheating I think is going to be here forever Um, it's just the mindset of people that they have to cheat because they're not good at anything and I hate cheaters and I've posted our videos before Um, yeah I, I don't mind back buttons I have used scuff controllers on PS4 before I've got the uh, new PS5 Pro controller, but all that does is gives me buttons to use. 
Um, yeah, it's no different to having a driving game and taking out your PS5 controller and using a steering wheel and accelerator and brake. No, no different. It's no different to having a mouse with five or six buttons on it that you can use um, instead of your two buttons up the top in your wheel. So, but these things, they take it to another level and actually give you those extra things like the Zen does and Zim and God knows whatever else. And now, as I said, with monitors that are actually going to uh, let you know where your enemy is, um, which has got to be undetectable because it's a monitor. It's not nothing programmed into your computer. Uh, same as these. It's not programmed into your PS5 or your computer. They're just a uh, pack that you add onto your controller. But um, anyway, that is me, Chico Bean. I just thought I would um, just let everyone know about it. Um, and yeah, I'm letting people know. But people in America, as I said, it's been out. I think it's been out for a couple of weeks or maybe a month. I'm not too sure. But they, and like you look at the views, 1,000, oh, 16,724 times viewed in the last 30 days. This thing is going to go off and people are going to use it and countries outside of these three countries, we're going to have to deal with it. And then all of a sudden, MSI bring this monitor out. We're going to have to deal with that as well. Um, and then as Jack Frags put with this program, it pretty much says you got a controller, but you got a mouse, and, yeah, it gives you a lot of other benefits. Um, what do we do? Yeah, yeah, stop playing video games. Well, no, I'm not. Oh, I love playing video games, but... Yeah, it's frustrating. You know, I think the mindset is you just go into a game now and, you know, everyone tries to be competitive, but just go into the game now with a mindset of, hey, I'm just going to have some fun and, you know, uh, who cares about your KD and all that sort of shit? These people are cheap, dude. Um, but that's unfortunate. Anyway, that is me, Chico Bean. I'm out. Bye-bye. <laughs>